الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله وبعد continuing with pieces of morning motivation based upon the Quran and the Sunnah because the best speech is the speech of Allah and the best guidance is the guidance of our Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam and this morning I will talk about a topic due to an email that I received and in the email the sender mentioned that they feel that they are a failure in life. Subhanallah. And how can they escape this feeling? And these sentiments may be shared by many others because many people, illa man rahimullah, look for love, likes, and relevance in the wrong places. When I received this email, one of the things that came to mind was an amazing hadith of the Prophet wasallam that comprised of a beautiful story. A story that highlighted that every believer is valuable and precious with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and the stronger a person's faith, the more precious they are with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. The Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, he said in the authentic hadith, المؤمن القوي خير وأحب إلى الله من المؤمن الضعيف وفي كل خير. The strong believer is better and more beloved to Allah than the weak believer and in both of them, there is good. In this story, brothers and sisters, Zahir radiallahu an, this noble companion, he wasn't attractive in the eyes of the people, but the Prophet ﷺ loved him because of his qualities and praiseworthy traits and characteristics. One day, the Prophet ﷺ saw him and he hugged Zahir from the back. Zahir عن, didn't know who he was. He said, let me go. Who is this? And in the hadith, the Prophet ﷺ playfully said, who's going to buy this person, meaning Zahir? Zahiri replied to the Prophet wasallam. he said, Oh, Messenger of Allah, therefore, by Allah, you will find that I am worthless. Look at the response of the Prophet wasallam. The Prophet wasallam said, Lakin عند الله لست بكاسد. However, with Allah, you are not worthless. Or he said, Lakin عند الله أنت غالب. However, with Allah, you are precious and valuable. Yes, brothers and sisters, with Allah Azza wa Jal, the believer is precious and valuable. We have to look in the correct place. You cannot look for love, likes and relevance from strangers. Because when people do not receive it, look how indecent people are behaving on the internet. And that immoral, indecent behavior, it leads to more misery, whether you can see it or not. And it leads to humiliation. In this life and the hereafter, if the person disobeys Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Each and every one of us, brothers and sisters, should work on pleasing Allah azza wa jal. Yes. No person can love themselves correctly unless they know their purpose in life. And our purpose in life is to worship Allah Azza wa Jal alone without any partners. And to travel through life upon a siratul mustaqim, the straight path to the best of our ability. And if we slip, we repent Allah Azza wa and we get up. Do not look for love and likes from the people because pleasing the people is something you will never attain. And the people, some of them today, they will love you. Tomorrow they will hate you for no reason except that they, they are unhappy with their own selves. 
Brothers and sisters, look, the Prophet taught us a lesson. Lakin Allahi anta ghalin. However, you Zahir, with Allah, you are valuable, you are precious. It doesn't matter how the people see you. The believer is precious with Allah. Is valuable with Allah. That is why, brothers and sisters, we have to understand this properly and correctly to avoid depression and anxiety and also humiliating behavior on the internet. As Al Imam Shafi'i rahimahullah he said, pleasing the people is something that you will never attain. Some people will be pleased, some people will be unhappy. So focus on pleasing Allah Azza wa Jal. Tabarak wa Ta'ala. And if you love Allah Azza wa Jal more than anything else, then Allah Subhanahu wa Ta'ala will aid you and assist you. If you obey Allah Azza wa Jal, then Allah Subhanahu wa Ta'ala will protect you. And the person that loves Allah Azza wa Jal and loves what Allah loves, and, lo and loves those whom Allah loves, and hates what Allah hates, that person will never look at themselves as being a failure, bi'idhnillahi ta'ala. Brothers and sisters, we must stop looking for love and likes from social media. The believer is precious with Allah. And the more that they actualize faith, Iman, the more precious and valuable they are. And we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for success in this life and the hereafter. And we ask Allah azza wa jal for paradise. Wa jazakumullahu khayra.